Hello and welcome back to another episode of Talk Bricks. Michael here and I'm so excited to bring you guys some LEGO DC Comics superheroes news. Today we found some pictures on Amazon Japan of the new set featuring Ra's al Ghul. And here we have set number 76056, Batman Rescue from Ra's al Ghul. This set contains four minifigures, Ra's al Ghul, Talia al Ghul, Robin, and Desert Batman. And here we have the scene, which seems to take place in Nanda Parbat, the home to the League of Assassins. In this set, Batman will be sporting an all-new vehicle, which seems to be some sort of desert buggy. I really like all of the designs, including those giant gold wheels, as well as some of the accent details from the logo at the front to some of the panel detailing on the side. The other section of the build features a large staircase, a cage to trap Robin, some booby traps and weapons, as well as a large door. Just to the left of the door, we'll see some carvings on the wall, which seem to indicate some fun Easter eggs. The last small build included with this set is the Lazarus Pit. Here we can see that there's a stickered piece, which will act as a catapult. The Desert Batman minifigure is a unique inclusion in this set. I really like the dark tan look of his suit, but I'm a little bit confused why we have the older version of the cowl. The Robin minifigure also seems to be an interesting variation on ones we've gotten in the past. Getting Ra's al Ghul in a set is a fun surprise. He has a really interesting cape detail with that dark green color throughout, and I really like the printing on the side of the hair. Talia al Ghul was also a nice addition to help fill out his family and the League of Assassins. Overall, I'd say this is a really nice set. It seems like it's going to come in around that $29.99 price range, which I think is very fair for this set. I like the Batman vehicle here and the build that we get, and this set also helps us cover a corner of the Batman universe that we haven't yet covered in LEGO form. But those are just my thoughts about the set, and I'd love to hear yours in the comments down below. Let me know, what did you think of the set, and will you be picking it up? And if you like what you saw here, don't forget to leave me a thumbs up down below and subscribe to make sure you don't miss out on any of my upcoming videos. That's all the time we've got for today. Thanks and have a good one. Hey guys, Michael here. Click here to watch all the news about the 2016 superhero sets and don't forget to subscribe.